few ever stayed in a haunted hotel room. This family had the shock of their lives when they discovered that their hotel room in Crete was haunted. Years ago, when Mr. and Mrs. Miller, their daughter and their relatives went on holiday to Crete, they managed to get adjacent rooms at the hotel in which they were staying. The rooms were identical in every way, apart from the room in which Mr. and Mrs. Miller were staying in, which was somehow, and for no particular reason, darker. Days and nights went by as the family enjoyed their holiday. Then, halfway through the week, Mrs Miller was woken up by a rattling sound, as if someone was moving things about on the dressing table in front of the mirror at the foot of the bed. Mrs Miller sat up to see the figure of a man standing at the dressing table. She presumed it was her husband, a little worse for wear, after a drink and in the process of making his way to the bathroom. Mrs Miller sat for a while, watching her husband fiddling with things on the dressing table. Then, tired of waiting, she decided to lie back down, upon which she found her husband lying in the bed next to her. Suddenly she shot up and reached for the light switch, waking up her husband at the same time. It then struck her that the hotel room must have been broken into, and there was a stranger in the room. When she sprang up out of bed to confront the intruder, she found that there was no one there. After the event, Mrs Miller doubted herself and put it down to a strange optical illusion caused by the mirror late at night. The couple decided to tell their daughter the following morning that the mirror seemed to emit a strange illusion of a man late at night and that she shouldn't be worried by it. However, on saying this, their daughter told them that earlier that night she had heard something rattling about on the dressing table at the bottom of the bed, which had woken her. When she looked down, lying in the same position, she saw what she thought was a man in the room. Too terrified to move, she thought the room had been broken into and that her life was in danger. Shortly afterwards, she inexplicably fell into a deep sleep. After comparing what they had both seen, Mrs Miller and her daughter concluded that there must have been a ghost in the room that night. Following this event, the family always kept a side light on, just in case, but were never troubled by anything again in the hotel room. Although there was no one to ask, Mrs Miller and her daughter did wonder if a young man had once lost his life in the room. This strange event has always stayed with them. If you too have stayed in a haunted hotel room and would like to share your story, please get in touch.